by another British composer named Gilbert Vinter. This piece is called Hunter's Moon, and it was written for French horn in 1942. This piece makes great use of the characteristic idea of the French horn being the sound of the hunt. And so the story unfolds here. We have uh, the hunter who decides to go out for a ride on a moonlit night, but he has prepared for this journey by partaking in one too many spirited beverages, shall we say. And so the rider is a little unsteady in the saddle of his horse, uh, and he continues on his way. The composer uses very interesting uh, musical ideas and techniques on the French horn to represent the sound of uh, shots being fired and the sound of the guns that are used on the hunt. So you'll hear that. Uh, the rider then encounters bushes and brambles and ultimately falls off the horse. He is knocked unconscious and he begins to dream about the beautiful goddess Diana, who is the goddess of the hunt. Eventually our poor bedraggled hunter comes to. He mounts back on his horse and continues his journey at a fantastic gallop towards the conclusion of the piece. So our soloist tonight is our own Amy Horn. Amy is a native of Fremont, Ohio. She holds her bachelor's degree in music education and performance from Bowling Green State University. She joined our organization shortly after graduating from Bowling Green in 1987, but she has since earned her master's degree from Catholic University and holds her doctoral degree from the University of Maryland. So ladies and gentlemen, here to recreate this journey under the hunter's moon, would you please welcome Dr. Master Gunnery Sergeant, Amy Horn. <laughs> 